guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a blue smoky eye i know it's kind of weird to be starting off the new year with a blue smoky eye makeup tutorial but if you don't know i am a zeta so our 100th year is coming up january 16th so i thought this video would be very good for my sorrows out there who happens to come across the video that just wants to do a blue smoky eye for um, centennial or just anybody who wants to do a blue smoky eye in general but this is mainly meant for my soul out there so yeah i hope you guys like it but before we get into the eyes don't forget to subscribe don't forget to hit that bell notification get notified when i upload a new video as well as thumbs up this video for more eye makeup tutorials that we will be bringing out throughout the entire year um obviously the base is already done so i'm gonna leave all the stuff that i use for the base down below in the description box so without further ado let's get into this eye makeup tutorial all right guys so i brought you in as close as i can i'm going to be looking over here at my viewfinder to make sure i'm in focus but as you can see this is what the eye looks like i wanted to save some time so yeah let's focus now on this eye so the main palette that we're going to be using today is the sitting pretty palette from kylie cosmetics so the first color that i'm going to, no first color the first thing i'm going to do is prime my eye i'm using my nyx proof it i still don't like this thing but i have it and i need to use it up before i find something else to use so and to set our primer i'm going to take this color here which i believe is vanilla on vanilla i'm going to take that and just use my finger to set the eye primer so next i'm going to go into this color right here which i believe is mascal mule maybe let me see. One, two, three, four. Yep, Mascara Mule. She has the the um the names on the back, so I'm up here trying to make sure I have the right names. So we want to take that and put it in our above the crease area. And then on top of that, I'm going to take Tequila Tangerine and put that right on top. Make sure that you bring it out as well. We basically want to blow this whole look out. And if you can hear any noise, I have thin behind walls, so you probably can hear like knocking my neighbors all that stuff because i have thin ass walls so they probably can hear me recording this video right now all right so now that we got that layered down i'm going to take a smaller blending brush and i'm going to dip into pre-game and into mimosa Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I'm gonna tip my help, my heel. I'm gonna tip my head back and find my dip of my crease and start there. And then once I laid it down, I can go back like this and start blending and adding where I need to. If you have this palette, just know, we know. It's very dusty, there's a lot of kickback, but that really doesn't bother me. But just so you know, it was looking to get it, because I believe I got mine from Ulta. Um, it's a lot of kickback if you don't have it, but if you have it, then you know. So now we're going to dip into the color Blackout. And we're going to focus this mainly on the outer edge and a little bit in the middle of our crease area. 
because we will be cutting the crease so yeah that part is very time consuming just so you guys know but I'm gonna start off at the end blow it out So now I'm going to take another fluffy and blending brush and use that to just blend out everything together to make it mesh. Make sure you don't take the black up too high because you don't want to cover up the crease color that we did. We still want that to show but we just want it to be blended together. So now I'm going to cut the crease. I'm taking my HD Pro Conceal from LA Girl in the color Almond. This was a mistake of me buying this, so I'm like, I have to use it some way somehow. So I use it to cut my crease. <laughs> and we're not doing a full cut crease. We just want to cover up this part here so that way the blue can really, why am I sipping so much? So that way the blue can um, really pop. And where my fold is, is where I'm going to make sure I don't go past that fold. I'm going to take the one, um, our small blending brush that had the black on it and start blending out the edges. And if you need to, you can dip back in into the color blackout and, you know, dab a little bit more if you need to. Which I'm going to do that and just tap. So then the next color we want to take is party animal yeah we're gonna take party animal which is this blue here which is the main star of the show and just of course tap that over where we cut the crease at Alright, so mainly this portion of the eye is done. So now we're just going to line our eyes. I'm going to take my NYX gel liner in jet black and line my top line. And I'm using the Morphe M217, which is like an angled um, eyeliner brush. I'm just going to curl my eyelashes. I'm using my Laura Mercier. And for lashes today, I'm going to take my E1. These are from AliExpress. I need to order some more because I think the E1s and the E8s are like my favorite. But I want to try the E9s and the E7s, I believe. Um, yeah. So I'm going to prep my lashes. Now y'all might think this is excessive, but I used two um, eyelash glue. So first I'm using my duo brush on eyelash glue in the color dark. I get that all over. And then just on the edges in the middle, I use I Envy um, Strip Lash Adhesive with Aloe in the color Clear. And again, this is going on the edges and in the middle. 
since those are the places that um, seems to always rise up throughout the day. So this is what it looks like when I do that. So I'm just going to let them chill for a while while we finish up the lower lash line. So for the lower lash line, I'm going to take pregame and mimosa again. And just run that underneath of my lash line. And then for highlight underneath of the eyebrow and for the inner corner, I'm taking the color, give me a second, Martini Mama, which is like a shimmery gold. Before we add our lashes, I'm going to take my black eyeliner from NYX in the color black. <laughs> you know, I never knew just this thing was waterproof. Okay, so I lied. One more thing before we put on our lashes. You got to put mascara on. So I'm taking my Maybelline Snap Scara. Snap Scara. Now we can take our lashes because they should be ready to go. All right, so we back. So this is what the lashes are looking like. So now the last thing that we have to do when it comes to the eyes is eyeliner. So the first thing I'm going to do is take the black and focus that out in the outer edge of our line and attach it to the gel liner that we just created. So I'm start at the middle of my eye and go out that way. And then I'm going to take this Royal Blue eyeliner from LA Girl in the color Cobalt. And that's going to go in the rest of the eye. And the eyes are done. So now let's move on to the lips. So the first thing I'm going to do is take this brown lip liner from Milani in the color Dark Coffee. Yeah, my lips are so damn dry. Yeah, I had to grab some chapstick because my lips are like super dry. See, much better. And the first color we want to take is the color Peach Buff. It's a matte from Maybelline. It looks like this. Focus it mainly in the middle. I'm telling you, if you do makeup, having a towel where your dust is, is like a game changer. Anyway, so now you can leave it like this, call it a day, but I'm going to put some lip gloss on. So I'm taking my Moon Child, which is the Kathleen Lights and Colourpop collab. Gonna spray our face with the Morphe Continuous Spray, which is my fave. Okay, guys, so this is the final look right here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it's a lot, I know it's very out there, but what can you say? It's a hundred years Zeta, so I have to do it. I just have to go all out. So I really enjoyed it. It's amazing what you can do when you take your time and just blend 
to the gods you know you come out with an amazing look like this so i hope you guys enjoyed it again please don't forget to subscribe please don't forget to thumbs up this video as well as hit that bell notification to get notified when i upload a new video and i'll see you guys in my next one bye